Uh, here it is. Here it is. Oh, dear, 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 dear. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Alaskan Road Truckers. And in this very, very special video, um, I thought I might start off right here because uh, as I as I was doing in between my other recordings, um, I was uh, doing a delivery. Uh, I'm all the way up here in um, Prado Bay and um, yeah so this is where my destination is I am literally at my destination uh, I was turning into this area right here and it seems like my um, bumper clipped through uh, the fence and now I am stuck and you can actually see uh, I, like I'll even reverse I am stuck I go forward and I'm still stuck and yeah I cannot move at all uh, you'll also see I have some major damages um, yeah the game completely completely freaked out as soon as this bumper um, touched this fence um, this is not how I came into this parking um, yeah, the, uh, I was quite nicely in line and um, yeah, it uh, clipped through, it completely jumped to the side and yeah. So I figured I might want to, wanted to show you guys this, uh, it's quite hilarious. Um, I do have still some time left so maybe we can finish this job up. So if I go back into my cabin and I call for help, uh, tow the truck to a workshop. Uh, we'll fix up the truck. We'll finish up. We'll finish up this. Um, uh, we'll finish up this uh, this task, and then um, maybe if there's time left, that we can do a second job. So yeah, let's quickly fix up all the things that are quite broken. My right light, right headlights are completely broken. Uh, engine is 45%. Oof, that's uh, that's a big A now. Uh, left headlights 33%. Air filter 60%. Um, the rest ones, these ones, I'm I'm really not gonna fill up. Uh, maybe I'll fill up my coolant and oil. Uh, windshield wipers are still good. Radiator is still good. Battery, I'm not gonna replace that. That's still fine. And let's fix that up. What I'm also going to do is I am going to remove this bumper. Um, I will can I not even just oh, okay okay I am going to remove that because I don't want um, because essentially it is this bumper here that actually um, clipped through the fence so just to make it a lot easier on myself I am going to remove that bumper so yeah uh, now we're back on that one okay I have done a few few customizations so I've, uh, I know it's a bit late to the party but um, some Halloween tradition uh, I thought would be nice the other ones that we do have is like this bear one for, uh, well with the Alaskan the final frontier uh, we have the usual Sasquatch um, we have this one some nuclear waste one which also actually looks quite cool actually uh, maybe I'll maybe I should do this one because this one does look cool and then there's a gold rush one as well and then the other ones are just plain colors so yeah um, maybe let's, let's 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 rip out the nuclear waste one that looks pretty awesome okay so we are out and uh, the uh, uh, where is my trailer is my trailer still... Um, is this my trailer? I am not sure. Let's... Uh, let's have a look. Unless my trailer is at the location so yeah i'm still driving the class 3 truck 
Um, let's, uh, yeah, I'm not sure if that is my trailer or not. Cannot remember. And I'm still sleepy. So let's just double check the map again. Because it says my trailer is here behind me. Oh. And it's parcels. Maybe that is my trailer. Let's let's see if I can hook up that trailer. Although it is a bit of a squeeze in here. I doubt it's the, the white trailer. I think it is the blue trailer. This is going to be very interesting to get out of. But let's see what we can. Um, it doesn't say anything. I don't think this is my trailer. Um, so where is my trailer then? Because I, I honestly cannot see it. It says I'm on top of my trailer. So maybe, maybe it is that. So let's uh, turn the... I kind of lost my trailer. We I mean, we can't lock it in unless I'm not in line with it. Maybe I'm too far back. This much forward. I'm pretty sure it should be about, should be about there. Yeah, see, I can't, I can't lock it in. I think chances are I might just have to um, do another job and leave this trailer. Let's just go back to where we were and see see if our trailer is perhaps there or not. So the winter is quite unforgiving. Um, I'll show you now. Uh, basically, if we go back into the truck, we can see our windows have been frosted up, so hence me just driving like this for now. Uh, but the next job that we're going to do, we'll do it um, from within the cabin, and then we'll basically do it very, very neatly. Okay, so the trailer is not here, uh, because this is where I was. Um, yeah, I actually don't know where my trailer is, and because I suspect that other trailer is the, is mine, but for some reason I cannot um, take it. Uh, uh, no, I'm just uh, messing about. Uh, I cannot. That's closed off. Yeah, so I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the hit and cancel the order 
because the thing is you know it, it tells me to go here and my trailer is right there but I cannot grab it so let's cancel the order okay I've paid the fine that's perfectly okay and let's go to show available jobs and let's see if we can grab a job here we have one for seven thousand um seven thousand there no jobs there one for ten thousand and one for two hundred okay let's do the ten thousand we want to be where we were so reverse up here uh, but before we accept this job let's um, do some maintenance let's get some sleep um, let's eat some food and then uh, then we'll accept the job it's a quite a very interesting start to this video um, I just thought you guys might find this interesting uh, because yeah it's um, it was very uh, yeah I need to switch off there we go switch off that yeah let's uh, get some sleep quickly and then we'll eat something as well uh, let's sleep for 80% Okay, um, we have some mac and cheese. Yeah, let's have some mac and cheese for. Uh, oh, it is dinner time. Uh, oh, no, oh, nine four five. No, it's morning time. Okay, mac and cheese for breakfast. Every every, every man's dream. We go. Uh, we might need another uh, mac and cheese. Yeah. My apologies we can hear my dog barking uh, I think he was barking for this uh, beeping of the microwave <laughs> there we go okay we are full so let's go back to the pit and let's climb out okay, do we have our scraper yes we do we need to just clean our windows quickly go and windshield Repair. Okay. okay, well, let's hope the windshield looks a little bit better. Uh, let's go and accept that job. Or uh, 10,001, yes. Okay, this is, there's, a, there's one for 12,000 and 16,000 actually. Oh, but the license required is uh, uh, apparently nothing. Um, but there is one for 12,000. Maybe we should do this one, actually. Yeah, let's let's do this one. Okay. There's our trailer. Oh dear. Okay. Uh, let's see if we can... If the heater does anything. Uh, let's see. Aha! Okay just for this part just going to or when hooking up on the trailer just going to do it in uh, third person mode because it's just easier okay that went earlier Here. A little bit. There we go. Okay. Out. Put that on. Green cable first. And the red cable. All the red plug. Plug, plug. 
Okay, let's lift up the supports. And we are transporting spare parts to Jet Blast. Now, where is Jet Blast? That is a thousand one hundred miles away. So I'm assuming we are going all the way down. All the way down. Uh, yeah, all the way down to there. So this is going to be a long trip. Okay, let's get to it. Go. Uh, break. Let's be off. Let's, let's, don't think there's anyone coming. Great. Yeah, so um, if I'm not mistaken, this is the first time that you guys are experiencing winter in my videos. Uh, my first video uh, I did when I bought this truck um, did have winter. Um, so, but in between, I really do hope the weather changes again because I actually want to show you guys that. Uh, winter in this game is very, very unforgiving. Uh, there was this one spot where there was actually an avalanche ar uh, across the road and that's where some of the damage on my truck and um, cargo actually happened. It was uh, quite crazy. It was close by here actually. And I literally had to drive in between the trees um, to actually <laughs> get past it. Um, because I don't have the perk yet to be able to remove that kind of um, debris. And uh, yeah, so that was quite an exciting uh, uh, moment. Uh, I wish I had actually recorded it because yeah, that was actually quite something else. But on to other things. Um, how are you guys? Uh, I'm doing fine this side, uh, doing a lunchtime video here. Uh, you guys will see it actually tonight, uh, well this afternoon, five, uh, five my time. Um, but yeah, basically just a quick lunchtime video. Uh, this weekend I was a bit busy, so that's why there were no, no videos released over the weekend. Um, I wish I could, uh, could have done that, but unfortunately um, I was out and about. Uh, my sister and her fiance had a bachelor bachelorette party, or well, dinner. So yeah, Saturday night we were away. Um, we also slept over at a B&B. Um, it was just for, you know, uh, we had a fun time, uh, we didn't really want to uh, drive, so yeah, uh, trying to be responsible wherever possible. But also, guys, uh, thank you very much. Um, I, I definitely have to thank you guys. Uh, we are currently sitting at 32 subscribers. That is amazing. I never thought um, I would get to this point. Um, like a lot of people do say that, a lot of people say um, even when when they get to a uh, thousand or a hundred thousand or a million, um, they they tend to say this. But for me, um, I mainly did this for like j just going at it. Like I never really thought that people would actually like watching my my content. So uh, all in all, thank you very much. Um, I have tried my best to bring you the, the best type of content that I can. Uh, obviously I'm still learning other than like making content. Um, so yeah, it, it's it's definitely it's definitely been an amazing journey. Um, but definitely guys, uh, it, give 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 me your suggestions. Uh, I am very, very open to suggestions. Um, is there anything that you want to see in this game? Uh, do you want me to travel? Uh, more travel less. Um, what kind of uh, content do you guys really want to see? Um, is if there's something I can cover, please, please, please let me know, and I will do my best to be able to cover that. Uh, if there's any other games that you would like to see, uh, also let me know. Um, I have been thinking about doing a Euro Truck Simulator um, uh, series as well. Uh, I have installed the game and I have configured uh, Pro Mods as well, uh, just to have the Pro Mods expansion on there. Uh, so that that goes with every other expansion in there as well. So Pro Mods is kind of like a revamped version of the whole game. Um, more roads, uh, different uh, or revamped cities. It just 
makes the game so much so, so much better um so definitely guys please let me know if you would like to see a, a euro truck simulator series as well uh where we can possibly build an empire because that there it is a little bit different so there's different mechanics in that game um where basically you can hire people to drive uh drive your trucks for you and uh, there's tons of different cargo there so um we can check out the different types of cargo and so on and so forth so yeah guys let me definitely let me know yeah so uh, on a separate note um for my company uh where i currently work at uh, we have a year-end function coming up soon and our um, uh, our theme is masquerade so i decided to actually go and have a look around online to see uh, what i can 3d print for it because last year we had a pirate party and so we all dressed up like pirates and this year it's masquerade um, so i went online and looked for like a, a like a mask um, to be to 3d print so i am actually actively 3d printing a mask for myself um, which actually looks pretty freaking awesome. Uh, once it's done, I'll maybe include the mask in the in the in video uh, just to share it with you guys. So it's, I, th I think it looks pretty awesome. And um, my my whole perspective on 3D printing is it's amazing. Like how far technology has gotten to be able to do that. Like just watching the 3D printer go about it and printing something. Um, it's that technology is amazing it, it honestly it honestly amazes me about like what could what you can do these days um i've three printed quite a few things already um but every time when i three print it just boggles my mind uh, like in terms of how technology just goes further and further and further um so yeah that's that's one of my favorite things to do is to three print stuff um yeah so that that's actually pretty awesome but we do have a very long drive ahead of us. Um, but as you can see, also slightly, um, uh, it's, uh, it might be a bit difficult in the, in, in the video. But if you look through the windows in front, uh, that you can see it's starting to frost up a bit. Everything is a little bit more blurry-ish. Now that is where the scraper comes in, because your windows actually frost up completely uh, eventually, and your uh, windshield wipers actually get stuck then they can't work anymore because they've frozen stuck so um yeah basically uh, every now every now and then i will have to climb out and actually um fix up my windshields and just scrape scrape off all the ice so yeah you can actually see with the the, the top part of the windshield where that that uh, black um, visor is um you can see how uh, weird the line is so that's the that's the frost on the on the glass so eventually it just gets worse and worse and worse and you can actually see now it, it just uh here it is here it is oh dear 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 dear, 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 dear. i'm gonna crash yeah so this is the avalanche the very same one and i, th I believe i am stuck right now um let's see what's going on yes um yeah this is the avalanche <laughs> and i had already uh, damaged my cargo uh, i saw this a bit too late i did try and break and yeah that did not work out nicely um these uh, uh this camera is bog boggling out a little bit let's see what we can do What I want to do is I want to turn left. Uh, I cannot even turn left. I am out of here because the thing is also, if you were wondering, uh, let's do that. This. To remove a roadblock i don't have the perk yet so i cannot get this removed and i'm pretty sure a chainsaw won't help won't help for this 
uh, well, we can get into this. Um, yeah, <laughs> this looks weird. Um, yeah, so I cannot remove it. Um, yeah, so that was uh, quite interesting. Let's see if we can get out of here. Let's try and just go through the trees area here. There we go. Yeah, so there, basically, there you saw the uh, avalanche. I'm so glad I could show you guys that. Um, it's, it's it's so un unexpected, but also if you drive so fast, um, trying to brake. So yeah, it's 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 quite quite difficult to to brake. But as you can see, the windows are quite frosted up now. So let's turn turn off here quickly. Okay. That uh, we want to disable our wipers. Okay. Let's uh, clean our windshields quickly. Go. Doesn't look clean, but once we put our uh, windshield wipers on, then it will be fine again. Okay, like that. Look at that difference. There we go. Yes, we can. Okay. Um, I think uh, for now um, I'll do a, a montage again. So just a little bit sped up. Um, some music in the background and just enjoy the trip.
Happy day, everyone. Um, welcome back. Um, yeah, so we've got about 45 miles left to go. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the trip. Um, yeah, that uh, avalanche really messed me around. <laughs> so it was uh, quite an eventful, um, eventful uh, episode. And uh, yeah, so you guys saw that lack of uh, me glitching out so I could start. Um, couldn't find my trailer and then we had to abandon the job and then pick up this job. Um, I, th I believe this is also one of the longest jobs um, that we've done on this, uh, on this series. So yeah, guys, let me let me know what you guys think. Um, do you guys like these uh, longer, uh, longer trips? Should I do a lot more shorter trips? Um, definitely let me know down in the comments. And uh, if you feel like it, uh, feel free to leave a like uh, like on this video. Um, and if you're not, not, not subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. Um, yeah, to stay updated with this uh, with this series. So uh, let's get this trailer uh, of spare parts um, delivered. We are 17 miles away. And you guys obviously also saw how unforgiving uh, winter is. Uh, I had to stop uh, a few times uh, to scrape my windows, um, just to scrape off all the ice. And I can see already ice forming on it now already. So yeah, uh, let me let me know in the comments what you guys think about winter. Um, do you enjoy enjoy the scenery? Um, uh, do you think it will be a bit bothersome? Uh, what do you guys think? And uh, yeah, at least you guys also saw a few um, beautiful sceneries and uh, yeah, so like on the road, it was quite nice on the road actually. But let's go drop off this cargo. Where do we need to drop it? Over here. So there is one on the side here, which I'm a bit afraid of actually. Otherwise, we'll try and reverse park this one. Uh, or... Uh, go straight here. Let's see if we can get this trailer straight so to properly go in here. Yeah, not exactly what I wanted to do, but... We can straighten this out. Let's reset the camera. Let's stay as far away from the fence as possible so it doesn't glitch out again. There we go, five stars. Okay, uh, let's switch everything off. There we go, and just make sure our jacket is on properly. Put, put, there we go. So now we have our jacket on. Uh, let's take off the sockets. Okay. Put down the supports. Unlock the trailer, and now we just need to go handle our job. Right, buddy, we have delivered your cargo. We had a very, very interesting experience with uh, with an avalanche. I hope you pay me extra for that. <laughs> Yay, sup, dude? Okay, so. We are getting a total of 16, almost $17,000. This was a great job with it. 413 experience. That is fantastic. If we have a look now at our tracker. Um, yeah, so we have one point here. Oh, great. So we can actually unlock the customizer. Um, yeah, so maybe this I'll unlock in the next episode. Then we can go and update, upgrade our HQ again. But yeah, we are still on our road for 
the uh, class 4 truck. This is going to take a while uh, because I need to get, get three levels in order to get this truck, the class 4 truck. Um, I also really want to unlock these. Um, so yeah, we'll, we'll have a look at what we're going to do. And uh, yeah, that is it guys. So have a fantastic, fantastic day. Um, if you if you like this video, please feel free to leave a like. Um, if you're not, not subscribed, please feel free to subscribe as well to keep updated with this series. And maybe we can see uh, a few more uh, anomalies happen. Um, yeah, so on that note, guys, thank you for joining me and cheers.